Miriam and her young daughter Maria live in constant fear. They are affected by life-threatening floods up to five times a year. Rising seawater has depleted much of the coastline on the peninsula in Honduras where they live. After each flood, the sea moves closer to their village, leaving them even more exposed. Here, families have built their lives around fishing and farming, but everything is under threat as the flooding from the sea and a nearby river gets worse and more frequent. I panic when I hear the water is coming. I feel fear for my daughter. During a storm, the only way to safety is by boat. Safety canals, maintained with the support of Throkara, leads to dry land and security. After surviving a flood, they must begin again. Miriam has to salvage whatever hasn't been destroyed and simply rebuild their home. From the moment we know the storm is coming, we know we will lose something. We can't eat, we can't sleep. We're so worried. Elvia and Candido lived in a small home near Maria and Miriam. In January, 32 hours of strong wind and constant rain destroyed their home and five others. These are the remains. With Trocra's support, local communities have developed evacuation plans for flooding and hurricanes. These plans save lives and help people to protect themselves. Throker supports approximately 15 communities in this area. Millions of families and communities across the developing world cannot cope with the increasingly extreme weather that has developed in recent decades. Disasters hit the poorest people hardest. For the most vulnerable, it's a question of when, not if, they will face disaster again. By making a donation today, you can be there for communities like Maria's, helping them prepare and providing assistance when disaster strikes.